Not a bad day on this final Saturday in the month of March across Northeast Kansas. A lot of sunshine today, albeit a cool one. High temperatures were below average across Northeast Kansas on this Saturday. Here's a live look outside from your tower sky cam right here at KSNT News. Down to just 47 degrees tonight as that cloud cover creeps up on us overnight into tomorrow morning. High temperature at the station today, 58. Low temp this morning, 38. Temperatures across the central portion of the country uh, tonight, kind of all over the board. I've uh, seen those green color really across the eastern plains, but some of the western plains seeing some yellows and oranges and actually some red colors were for the highs today. High temperatures west of places like Pratt and Hayes, Kansas actually topped off in the middle 80s today compared to uh, the upper 50s across northeast Kansas. So you can see where that front has kind of stalled out across the central plains. And that's literally right off to our west. Here are those temperatures across northeast Kansas tonight, 46 degrees. Up in Marysville, Marshall County, along US 36 to Hiawatha and Powhatan, 42, 47 degrees right now in Linden, Osage County, and some 50s across the Cow River Valley from Wamigo to St. George and K States in Manhattan. We'll track out your temperature forecast hour by hour for you using Future Track. It's what it does best. Uh, watching that time right up in the title, 10 p.m. tonight. Future Track doing a pretty good job handling that temperature forecast. Temperatures in the 40s uh, past midnight. Low temperatures tomorrow morning, at least for our eastern counties. We will be a bit chilly in the middle and upper 30s, some lower 40s for the western half of the area. Daytime highs tomorrow after the cloud cover pushes out. We'll see some sunshine after lunchtime. Those high temperatures in the middle to upper 60s, maybe close to 70 degrees. Future Track running a couple degrees cool in the high temperature department over the past couple weeks or so. Still in that cool season. Low temperatures Monday morning. Uh, waking up, heading out the doors to work in school, some upper 30s. So some cooler air to start off your work in school week, but daytime highs again. Add three or four degrees to these numbers you see. We'll be pushing into the lower and middle 70s by Monday afternoon. Just some ground clutter out there tonight. Otherwise, we are dry across northeast Kansas. That could be changing heading into the pre-dawn hours of your Sunday. Here's satellite and radar. We are tracking some showers out of a clipper system off to our north and northwest tonight. This is a fast mover, uh, predominantly a cloud maker for us. I showed you it on a few track in my first weather, uh, but we'll show you it again. Here is that cloud cover uh, creeping up across northeast Kansas tonight. Stopping it here, 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. A couple green uh, blobs popping up on the screen indicating some slight chances for some scattered rain showers into tomorrow morning, but we dry things out and we clear things out. Tonight, 40 degrees, partly cloudy skies, a passing shower is possible. That cloud cover is already on the increase before you head to bed. 69 degrees for a high temperature on your Sunday. Maybe our western counties pushing 70 tomorrow. Middle 70s on Monday, a flirting with 80 degrees by Tuesday. And then for April 1st, temperatures will still be close to 80 degrees, Brooke. We actually reintroduce the chance for some storm. We'll track that chance as it gets closer. Just in time for April. Yes. Wednesday, we know it's going to rain a lot. No April Fools, though. I'm no. sorry. It wasn't a joke. No. <laughs> I forgot about that.